What is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Now I have talked about the SVT store in previous videos. I got the emblem on the top of my stock Eaton from them. I picked up a keychain when I was over at Carlisle Ford Nationals. And one of my favorite things that I've gotten from them is, and they've been making these for years, is a little personalized plaque that has your name and the information on, on your SVT car, and it goes on the stock ready to cover. Now, I did put a video on those products on the channel, so I'll put a little link up there in case you wanna check those out. But if you're like me and you change your stock radiator cover to one of those uh, beautiful aluminum Terminator covers, which I also detailed in a previous video, the only thing that I left me wanting was that plaque. And unfortunately, the plaque doesn't work on those custom radiator covers, so the stock radiator cover is now actually hanging on my wall as kind of like a decoration with the plaque on it. And uh, yeah, I got something really cool I wanna show you. So let's look under the hood. So there isn't too much room under the hood of this Cobra for uh, another plaque. As you can see, here's the uh, ready to cover that I installed. Really love it. Um, it unfortunately doesn't have a place to put a plaque. I was thinking about putting it here, here, but I don't know, it probably gets scratched or hit by the hood. I had thought about putting one right here on the stock fuse box cover, and there are aftermarks, aftermarket, excuse me, fuse box covers that are available, but most of them are chrome. Then I started looking at the firewall area. Now right there, I put that little SVT decal. I actually got that with a purchase, I think of that in that little uh, supercharger plaque. And I said, what about putting a size plaque there with all the same info that I had on the right ear? The problem was that the st sizes that are available at SVT store didn't really lend themselves to this area. So I got to designing, I got to measuring, and thanks to Marcy over at SVT store, we got something that should go right there. So here's what we picked up. It is a slightly smaller version of the SVT plaque that was on the stock radiator cover, and this should fit perfectly onto that firewall. Now, it does come with some super stick 3M tape, but over here I have some slightly stronger, so I might actually do double it up with two layers here. It's a little thicker, and I'm gonna show you where it's gonna go. I'm gonna take that sticker off and I'm gonna put it right there. I think it'll look pretty good, I really do. Uh, kind of a Selene-ish touch. It'll be out of the way, uh, not using any underhood real estate, but still you get that little personalization under the hood. So yeah, let's get working on it and put some double stick tape on it and do a quick install. I gotta be honest, I, I, I really like the way this looks. Let's pull off this guide tape, so at least it's straight. And I think that looks pretty good. It still has that little bit of a personalized touch. Like I said, kind of like a Selene-ish look. And still maintains the information. It's not huge, it's not loud, it's not obnoxious. It's kind of subtle. And uh, I gotta be honest with you, I kind of like it. So that's about it for this video. Like I said, not a huge tech video, but I, I, I like the way it kind of keeps a little bit of that SVT look. And a huge shout out to Marcy over at SVTstore.com. I'll leave a link in the description where you can uh, check out all the stuff that they have there. And she was able to make me a custom size um, plaque for a really reasonable price. And I really like the way that looks. So let me know what you think about that. I'd love to hear your comments in the comments section down below. And of course, thank you so much for watching. It's greatly appreciated. And do me a favor, if you like this video, make sure you click that like button. 
or better yet make sure you subscribe to get all the latest content here on the channel well like i said i'll see you on the next one